Is this supposed to be one of those art movies? It's a Gustave Corbet. No, it's very sexy Yoko Ono. Oh, look at those lips. She's parched. Just as a I already hate you. I don't even know you. How do they storyboard this? It's like we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna zoom in on some kneecaps. This is man ray peoples. I do not detect hot, ambiguously continental women posing, so I'm a little disappointed, I will say. Alright, did Pink Floyd show up yet? Yeah, what's going on with all this psychedelic business? <laughs> I'll bet you $20 she jumps. Just think of how cold it was to be done. Look at all that. God, I hope she jumps. Oh, no. Let me come around. Let me get the review. What's in store? It's a, in, in a way, it's very much a. Uh, She's about to hit the age where it doesn't matter anymore. Another green screen experiment. I paid this guy 60 bucks to move my fridge, and look what he's doing, he's tying on these fancy knots. What is this, sex or something like that? What's going on? What, did he even take the stuff out of the fridge? <laughs> this guy is cakey with all these crazy knots. So I just got out of art school, and I'm really ready to become, like, a famous, Artist. I think there's not enough performance based installation work <laughs> dealing with identity and, and wigs. <clears throat> this is what they show the French opticians to see if you need a. Oh. No, it's just the French's new way to, to, for us to figure out how to speak their language. <laughs> oh. They're trying to subliminally teach us how to speak French. Like they want us to speak French. I thought they like to make fun of our bad French. You have to take acid and watch this video and then you speak French. It's like <laughs> Roger Waters' late work, okay. That was amazing. <laughs> <laughs> well, that, well, I mean, well it's also it. true. Yeah, yeah that's oh, it's true. I, that is actually a, that is a real statement. Seconds now, right? Is this, is this uh, really absolutely. That's not the point. We can hear the echo. People are. She sounds like. like she sounds like, like Anne Frank. Frank. Well, Anne Frank. Is it Anne Frank? Yeah. You mean Helen Keller? No, uh, Helen Keller. That's what you have.
Is that a shadow man with big glasses? Is that big glasses? There's big glasses out there? No! <laughs> Somebody else! So what about Carrie Hill? Where the hell did big glasses go? Is it as good as Lady Rizzo's banana dance of earlier? Who saw that? That was good. There was less fog in that, though. Use a Q-tip! <laughs> it uh, falls off the... Uh, it feels like they're like, wagon and Tom Harvey documentary film from Walmart or something. Fall off the wagon and rolls into a field that produces. Chase him, I don't know why they're chasing him. Get away from there. Oh! Someone's like, it's something that's going to ask about right now. We're getting uh, the seal of disapproval from somebody who proportionately must be. 17 rows in front of us. <laughs> it takes a lot of patience to watch the quivering mound of Yoko. It's probably the longest anyone's made it into this. I know, <laughs> except for John. John said to the whole thing and he said, Oh my god, you're brilliant. I'm quitting the band for you. It really does make you appreciate Ringo and Warner, doesn't it? <laughs> Take us somewhere. Take us to a fucking Montmartre studio. Take us to a football studio. Take me to Kiki. I want to display out. I don't know where that ends up. Is that a positive party or a negative party? It's a positive party. Ooh. Ooh. This guy looks like he's having a pretty good time. What do you think, Sarah? Curtail your lenses? Uh, I'm sorry. 